Carbon Neutral Crypto Innovation in Sustainable Blockchain Analyzing the effect of digital technology on carbon emissions is crucial for China to achieve carbon neutrality. This exploration utilizes the bootstrap full and sub-sample techniques to investigate the connection between the blockchain market and carbon neutrality, which further evidences whether blockchain is a carbon neutral facilitator or an environmental destroyer. Before we start the video make sure to like and subscribe to our channel then you will not miss our new video. The conclusions present that the blockchain index BCI exerts positive and negative influences on the carbon neutral index CNI which is following the Sturpate model. The positive effects suggest that the rapid progress of blockchain technology accelerates the process of carbon neutrality and vice versa, underlining that blockchain is a carbon neutral facilitator in China. But this view could not be supported by the negative impacts, primarily due to the public health event and national carbon policy helping to raise CNI even during the periods with low BCI. Conversely, CNI has a positive effect on BCI revealing that achieving carbon neutrality in China requires the support of blockchain technology, which in turn promotes the development of the blockchain market. The exploration purpose of investigating the interaction between the blockchain market and carbon neutrality, also we study if blockchain is a carbon neutral facilitator or an environmental destroyer. Like a database ledger of all transactions, blockchain is essentially a decentralized database, Howell et al., 2023. Since blockchain is characterized by decentralization, no central trust, and immutable and cryptographic security, it is entering the vision of government decision-making, financial institutions and large enterprises. To be specific, blockchain has moved from theoretical discussion to practical application in several fields, including digital currency, payment settlement, credit financing, financial transactions, securities, insurance and so on. More importantly, the application of blockchain technology could be a boost to achieve carbon neutrality. Carbon neutrality means that emissions of carbon dioxide or greenhouse gases are offset by afforestation, energy conservation and emissions decrease. By the end of December 2021, 136 countries, 115 regions, 235 major cities, and 682 of the world's 2,000 top enterprises have set carbon neutral targets 1. And most of them consider blockchain technology as an essential way to achieve carbon neutrality. For instance, the proportion of blockchain applications in the energy environmental protection industry has increased from 16% in 2020 to 19% in 2021. Becoming the biggest hotspot of blockchain applications worldwide. Point two, however, a cryptocurrency based on blockchain technology might be an environmental destroyer. The production of cryptocurrency requires enormous computing power to solve complex mathematical puzzles, which significantly increases electricity use, causing a considerable increase in carbon dioxide emissions. For example, each Bitcoin transaction used 1,183.58 kilowatts H of electricity in 2021, equivalent to nearly a ton of carbon dioxide. This exploration can assist countries or regions in realizing the target of carbon neutrality by taking blockchain technology into account. China is one of the biggest carbon emitters around the world, accounting for 30% of the world's carbon emissions in 2021. As a large country in terms of population and energy consumption, China has never shirked its international responsibility to reduce carbon emissions. On September 22, 2020, the Chinese government put forward at the 75th session of the United Nations General Assembly that China would raise its intended nationally determined contribution, adopt more powerful policies and measures, and strive to realize carbon peaking by 2030 and carbon neutrality before 2060. In order to realize this target, China has applied or is preparing to the use of blockchain technology to relevant areas, including carbon emission management, energy and mining investment, trading, as well as resource monitoring, management. In the past decade, China has ranked first worldwide in the number of blockchain technology patent applications, accounting for about 63.2%.5 moreover. According to the International Data Corporation IDC, the five-year compound annual growth rate of China's blockchain market size will reach 54.6% by 2024, ranking first in the world. Against this background, Blockchain is also increasingly being used for national strategies such as carbon neutrality. 
For instance, the State Grid Corporation of China has launched the blockchain-supported green electricity transaction. Then the traceable and verifiable green electricity consumption certificates generated by blockchain have supported more than 12,000 market players in 25 provinces to carry out green electricity transactions. Therefore, it can be recognized that blockchain market development may have a close correlation with China's carbon neutrality target, but no studies have comprehensively investigated this topic. Besides, the extant literature neglects the intrinsic and changeable connection between them, and this exploration would fill these gaps. There are several innovations in this exploration. To begin with, the extant literature mainly focuses on the theoretical analyses of the blockchain market and carbon emission. The relationship between cryptocurrency and the environment, as well as the effect of digitalization on carbon neutrality in China. But no studies investigate the connection between the blockchain market and carbon neutrality, thus. This exploration is a groundbreaking effort to probe whether blockchain is a carbon neutral facilitator or an environmental destroyer in China. Secondly, the existing efforts of carbon neutrality primarily use carbon emission to reflect, but this measurement is not comprehensive. In order to cope with this problem, this exploration employs the SEEE Carbon Neutral Index CINA, to represent carbon neutrality. Furthermore, this exploration also selects Wind Blockchain Concept Index BCI, to reflect blockchain progress. This is also innovative among previous analyses. After that, we investigate the connection between BCI and CNI and find that there are positive and negative influences from BCI to CNI, coinciding with the Sturpate model. The positive effects indicate that blockchain is a carbon-neutral facilitator in China, while the adverse impacts cannot support this view. Conversely, CNI has a positive impact on BCI, suggesting the passive demand to realize carbon neutrality accelerates the progress of the blockchain market. These conclusions offer significant lessons for China to realize carbon neutrality through fully leveraging the role of blockchain and vigorously developing the blockchain market. Thirdly, the interaction between BCI and CNI might be changeable, which is neglected in extant efforts. Thereupon, this exploration uses the parameter stability techniques to prove the inaccuracy of the full sample approach. Hence, we utilize the more advanced sub-sample technique to capture the dynamic attribute of BCI and CNI. Theoretical Analyses of the Blockchain Market and Carbon Emissions The theoretical analyses between the blockchain market and carbon emissions have aroused wide attention and are primarily discussed from three perspectives. From the standpoint of carbon trading market, Pan et al. 2019 suggests that this digital technology could reliably record and transmit the flow of information and achieve peer-to-peer -peer transactions between supply and demand, which helps to lower the threshold of access to the market. If you find this video useful don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.